hello friends and welcome to my youtube channel so in this video i'm going to show you how to import this package and set it up so uh, the first thing you need to do is you have to buy this package and after that uh, I, you can see that i have this package right here now i'm going to double click on it and it is going to open this a uh, unity window so in here i am going to create a new project so just click on this new button and the project is going to be 2d and let's say testing multiplayer and hit create button now after that uh, this window will appear and make sure that each and everything is selected and click on the import button so this is going to import the package now now after importing the package you will see there are a lot of errors right now this is because we haven't imported the photon plugin yet so just go to the asset store and log in with your id and uh, search for photon pun 2 package so if So I already have it in my assets so I'm just going to import that so right now you can see that we have free version of pun 2 and the current version is version 2.9 and I am using unity 2018.3.1 and this project was built using 2018.2.4 .2 now just hit the import button you will see right here if you don't have this in your my assets you need to search here and download and then import this package now the same window will appear make sure that each and everything is selected and click on import now after successfully importing this package you will find this pun wizard here and it will ask you for your app id or email so you have to set up your free account on photonengine.com and in here you need to create a new app i already have a video on it so if you don't know you can just search on youtube now i have i have created several games so let's copy the app id from here and go back to unity and paste the id in here and click on the setup project now you can see that our project is now set up now close this window and in the photon server you can do the settings you can either change the logging to informational or full but we are not going to do that right now now after that in your console window you will just clear it and you can see that we don't have any errors now now the next thing you need to do is you need to go to the project in the scenes open up your sample scene sorry in the project you will see a scene folder click on it and in here you will find a sample scene just double click on it and now our sample scene is loaded now the next thing you need to do is you need to go to your build settings and drag this gameplay scene into your build settings now click on the build to build the project so i am going to create here a new folder and i am going to name it build select the folder and the project is going to be built Now you can see that our build is successful. Now I am going to click on this testing multiplayer. And we are going to select the 614 to 480 and check the windowed and hit play. Now again click on it and run another instance to check if the multiplayer is working or not. So now you can see that I have both builds right here. So in here I am going to 
type the name PC1 and here is PC2 now we are going to create a room so let's say room and hit create button and now you can see that on the other instance we have our available room now I am going to spawn the player right here and we can move it using WASD keys now I am going to join that room by clicking on the room and spawn our player right here now you can see that by hitting the right control we can shoot and our health is decreasing we killed PC1 and he's going to respawn in 5 seconds right here